Hey, it's a weekend preview show where we take a look at all the events that are going on around in Montgomery County and what you could be doing. And Mark, the world wants to know one thing. <laughs> Who cut the cheese? Who cut the bread? No, they is, don't want please. to know that. They don't. That know. was a disgusting yes, joke. By the way, Brad, uh, Shake Russell's going to be at Bernhardt Winery uh, the 29th. That's what, Saturday or? Well, Shake It On shake over Shake It there. On. Boy, I like uh, a couple of his songs. Oh, you do. Nice guy. Well, you know, the Texas Crawfish and Music Festival wraps it up this weekend. They started last weekend, but it's two consecutive I weekends. no idea. It's down in Old Town Spring. Have you? Are you a crawfish person? Have I'm you really crawfish? not. Uh, <laughs> Me neither. <laughs> I went to Willie G's uh, last week, and they had a pile of crawfish. I don't know how you know, many of them are Well, it's a lot of work for not a whole lot of, of, uh, mm. of meat. So, uh, are you a head sucker? I... Uh, or not to answer that. Not, on, on there. That's not good. Well, when, when it comes to, to, to those things. But anyway, the, the, the big festival attracts thousands of people, and they're doing like 25 tons of crawfish. There's 25 tons, probably Mark. Not a crawfish There's probably nine in pounds in all of that, but you know, 25 <laughs> tons. So if you want to, you want to see, hear the the music, a little Zydeco music, a little country music. Go down to Old Town Spring, check it out. Yeah, have, have fun. fun. You know, something, Brad, and uh, it's going to be hard to top that, but I think I've done it here. Saturday, Montgomery County is having. Healthy Kids Day. Ooh. It is spectacular. What they're going to do is go out and find a healthy kid and give them a cheeseburger and some Cheetos. Uh, that, that's That'll not, do it for That's them. not true. What they're going to do, I think, is they're going to invite healthy kids to the Lone Star Convention Center, and somebody will be at the door to, you know, Sir uh, Charles, I'm sorry, you're not healthy enough. Uh, we'll go out there. You're okay. Uh, that's all I can think of that they would do. Healthy uh, Kids Day? I didn't make that up. They're really having it, Brad. Oh, the heck with kids. I think we need to do like a what reality. What about the children? What about a reality show? The Women of Montgomery County. That's just scary, but no, I will be there. They're, they're going to do it here. How much are it's, a, it's a day out with the Housewives of Montgomery County. Fashion show, shopping, luncheon, survivor parade, health and wellness extravaganza, wow. on and on and on. And what does it cost to attend? Uh, Brad, it's, I don't know, Brad. $125. Okay, smokes. <laughs> They're serious about this. Look, uh, you're going to have to tell me the age of these women before I fork over uh, that I, kind of I don't know. I don't even oh. think you're the type of target market they're going I, after. I, I don't it's at so, the Woodlands Brad. Waterway Marriott. And, you oh. know, all of these things, you can go to the Courier website and, and sort of check out and see all the, the details on it. But if seriously, you're, you're we're not in, invited. Men aren't invited. You're not. I'm, the rest of the world is. If you got $125, I think you're invited. I bet you could get in free uh, with your I have to walk in and say, hey, yeah. I'm, I'm covering this for the courier I'm and the villager. some of these women. Jeez. Well, what Absolutely. else we got going? Well, I don't know what you're doing this weekend, but this weekend is the high-powered gun show out at the Lone Star Convention Center in Conroe. I loves me the Lone Star. I'm the, the big he's, he's gun shows. There's about four or five of them a year. It's so much fun, even if you're not looking for a weapon to wander around and see all these people packing heat. They got they got rifles and shotguns strapped on their shoulder with with tags on them for sale. They got kids walking around with guns. Yeah. It's it's a wild. They place. got tattoos of the Second Amendment on their hairy backs. Too. They do. That is. They uh, do. It it's a fun, fun thing just to go out, even if you don't support the Second Amendment. Which why wouldn't you? It's a fun place to go. Yeah. And so I, I'll be there. It's Saturday and Sunday. You know, I've seen uh, your gun, and it's... Uh, gun? It's, I got guns, buddy. Well, I was going to say them. that, but uh, yeah, this guy, this guy's loaded for bear. You or, bet. Uh, don't come knocking on my door late yeah. at night. By the way, uh, if you don't want to go there... Um, How could you do I'm not going to invite them over to my house, but I mentioned this last time. I know uh, all of you remember. The family's coming over, Bradford, uh, to the Hater House. We had to come up with a date. And, Brad, whenever you're having family over and you got this many people, do you know what it's like to schedule a day? My my uh, nephew, Clint, says, well, he's got four kids. He said, no, that date's bad for me. we got to come. I said, Clint, man, that's the best we can do. It's set in, I'm making uh, barbecue and everything, and I'm having them bring stuff. Well, I think if you're bringing this up on air, you've just pretty much invited everybody in Montgomery County. Yeah, I live over there in a uh, cut and shoot by yeah. the. Uh, but I really don't. But yeah, uh, absolutely. Yeah. Anyway, but we'll have a blast. I'm, yeah, sure. I'm sure you will. And everybody else, you should have a blast too. There's lots of things to see oh, and do. Man. The Housewives of Montgomery County, the high caliber gun show. Hey, what more do you need? You know, uh, before, and we need to. Uh, uh, wrap this up pretty soon, but get the ticket uh, this Friday and you'll see all kinds of stuff that's happening. And I did want to say this one thing, and it's negative, maybe I shouldn't. You know, last Sunday was Earth Day, and uh, I went to my courier to find something out, and I found one article written by a guy named Mark Hader. 
uh, that was uh, on the Earth Day, and it was so nice, and I thought there would be more support for the environment and all, but yeah, Conroe. Shows you mm -hmm. what we think of you, Mark. Really? I'm Brad Meyer. I write for The Courier and The Villager. Oh, this and, guy uh, is so talented. Mark Hader, columnist for The Courier and The Villager, and uh, we'll check uh, on stuff that's happening uh, next week. Check too. back and see if we know what we're doing yet. Yeah. See you next time. Next time, boys and girls. Anyway, uh, I'm talking. What time am I coming over the phone? You know, it's going to be successful.